Our Mojave Series entrance system is as much about the services that we offer as it is an excellent product. Our goal with this product's development was to demystify the difficult to maneuver energy codes and to offer the products and services needed by our customers for compliance. Mojave was created to solve issues resulting from products that were created to satisfy the energy code's prescriptive path instead of designing to take advantage of the various area weighted calculation methods. These issues being doors that are more than one and three quarter inches thick, which creates hardware compatibility problems along with an inability to upgrade existing entrances. Our Mojave series is only one and three quarter inches thick with specialized internal insulation and thermally broken with polyamide struts for optimized thermal performance. Mojave is designed for a range of uses, having three door style widths and the ability to accept common hinging and locking hardware. Mojave will be especially appealing in Sunbelt states due to the three inch narrow style model and the center pivot mounting option. While on the subject of Sunbelt states, California Title 24 compliance is the most difficult to achieve with a 0.45 U-factor requirement for doors, and Mojave can be configured for compliance using area weighting to produce storefronts ranging from very small to large in size. We have also created some useful tables for product selection that makes it easy to determine how Mojave can be configured for your project. California's 2016 energy standards, commonly known as Title 24 and implemented on January 1st of this year, are among some of the most stringent in the nation. Many states will eventually follow California's lead and adopt similar codes. California has established the goal that new building standards achieve net zero energy levels by 2020 for residences and by 2030 for commercial buildings. Understanding the compliance process. In its simplest form, one needs to first document what's required. This is usually the job of an energy consultant or the building designer. Make sure the fenestration performance information is placed directly on the plans. This will dramatically increase the likelihood that all responsible subcontractors and suppliers will see it up front. Most projects in a variety of states now require NFRC label certificates for the fenestration. Find out early in the bidding process whether or not this is a requirement, as these generally run several hundred to a few thousand dollars to produce. CR Lawrence U.S. Aluminum offers this as a service to our customers and will act as the specifying authority and handle all of the logistics required in obtaining the final report. There are two ways of obtaining Title 24 compliance. First is the prescriptive approach. This is the simplest method where the fenestration components of the building must meet prescribed requirements. It's also the least flexible approach, but it's simple because one only needs to show that the fenestration meets the minimum U factor, relative solar heat gain coefficient, and visible transmittance. Area weighting is an averaging of performance values of all fenestration units within the project. This permits the use of individual fenestration units that are above the minimum requirement to be offset by other fenestration units that outperform the minimum requirement. The other method to obtain compliance in California is called the performance approach. This method requires the use of special software approved by the California Energy Commission and allows for energy trade-offs between building features. It's estimated that over 90% of all new building projects in California are using this method for compliance. This approach most often requires an energy consultant to handle the project specific calculations. Sierra Lawrence US Aluminum can provide fenestration performance data in the form of NFRC bid reports in order to assist in the calculations.